What is going on guys? My name is Garrett, better known as Red Robin here in the Jobless Gamers channel. If you're new to the Jobless Gamers, I highly recommend you hit that subscribe button because I upload daily Grand Theft Auto 5 content. Today guys, I'll be teaching you how to get a free tank in GT Online. It's very simple and all you need to do is go ahead and attack tanks in the base. But you need to be on this hill, the hill closest to the singular water treatment plant on my right that you guys just saw. Now you want to maintain two stars, no more no less if you do acquire three stars this still is possible but it will be just a little harder because then helicopters will come after you now as you guys can see the tanks are driving towards the front of the entrance now normally you are not able to drive in or out of the base but because i cannot physically see the gate the tanks are easily just driving on out now they're driving right to me as you guys can see they'll be getting onto this path once they get on that path it's all mine this tank will be 100% mine and you may be asking well Garrett how do I acquire all you simply need to do is make sure you maintain your two stars you need to place yourself onto the road and once you get there after acquiring the tank you want to go ahead and call Lester for some reason I did it very different and you guys can do it this way as well I removed my wanted level before I got the tank which was very stupid and then after I saw the tank I attacked it as you guys can see I just fell off there's a tank rolling on by and now I decided to attack it, getting more stars. So after I attacked it, I want to go ahead and just steal this tank as fast as possible. Now, once the tank is out here and there is one tank, no more tanks will be spawning. As you guys can see earlier, there was about three or four tanks rolling down that road. Now there are none. The reason for this is right when I lost my stars, since I didn't have eye level or eye view of those tanks, they actually despawned. So once you do have your stars and you do have your tank, you're simply going to want to drive as far as possible away from the base. What this will do is it will lose your wanted level, letting you acquire this tank 100% all yours. Now the only downside to this method is that you are unable to actually keep this tank. Once you get out or once it's destroyed, that's it. You won't be able to put it in your garage, you won't be able to store it, nothing like that. This is just for, I guess, this session only. So if you were looking forward to placing this in your garage, you will not be able to do that because Rockstar did patch that out. But it is a fun way to just go ahead and cause mayhem and chaos in the town. But I warn you guys, you can get bad sport very easily with a tank. If you are unaware, it's very easy to get bad sport with a tank. So be very careful while you're driving around. Like always, guys, it's been Garrett, better known as Red Robin here in the Jobless Gamers. If you guys enjoyed this video, let's get a thousand likes. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new GTA Online video. Later, guys.